Welcome to my channel. And um, I do apologize, my son will, you'll probably hear my son in the background. And he's watching cars. <laughs> so anyway, um, I have a frame here that I purchased from the 99 cent store. This one's brown. I don't know if you can tell. And then I have a black one. And so, um, I kind of thought it was plain. And so what I did is I purchased the um, gemstones from Walmart. And you get like 550 of them. And I think they were like about, let's see here. It was 284 for these. And the picture frames were $1.99. Now, the, the um, rhinestones look really good on the black frame. However, I'm going to put the pearls on the brown frame. Now, I got um, these from the Dollar Tree, Dollar Store. And so I believe that these were just a dollar. So I should have probably got four packs. <laughs> but I'm going to make it work. But I'm just going to show you the one for the, for the black frame. And um, once I attach the, um, the gemstones to the frame, um, you know, I take out the paper that's in the back of the frame. And then I went on ahead and I glued the inside, like around the rim. Well, I guess I can show you here because it's the same thing. But I used, um, instead of using tape, I used um, the glue gun. Just kind of put some here, here, and here. And then attach the picture, put the frame back on, and voila, and this is what I got. So why, why did I make this? Um, my cousin is having has a birthday party, or not a birthday party, has a birthday coming up. And I just wanted to get her, you know, something simple that says a lot. Um, she loves my son very much. And so I just wanted to make her something that she could keep for a lifetime versus something that could possibly <laughs> just come and go so anyways let's get started and one thing that I did is that I wiped off the, fr the frame because I don't know what's on here so I wiped it off so I could make sure that it will stick. And so I'm just gonna peel it off. At first, when I first bought these, I thought they were individual, but they're not. So they're actually um, attached to a string. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. And then I'm just going to start, I, I noticed that I put it in a corner that didn't look right, so I'm just going to place it right in the middle. Now, when I first did this, I applied the, um, I used the glue gun, and let's see here, ah, okay, I used it on this one. You guys can see that. I use it on this one, but I noticed that it wasn't really sticking, and so I said, Okay, I'll just press hard on it, and hopefully, it'll just stay there. And you can pull it and stretch it out.
So you don't want to pull too hard on it, as you can see. <laughs> but that's okay if they come apart. It's no biggie. So this one kind of got stuck together but it's just a stick go ahead and place this in a, and I like I said I chose to use the middle part because I, I what I did at first is that I took the um, I took the sheet and I wanted to see how it would look if I put it on the outside and um, I was going to actually do two rows, but the, the gems are too big. So if they were smaller, it probably would have worked out. But <clears throat> but since they're a little bit bigger, then I just went on ahead and placed them in the middle. So I'm going to pull it just a little bit. Stretch it out. And then I'm just going to adjust it, make sure it's centered. Okay. And this one's probably only going to take probably about three. Let's see here. Yeah, so I'll just pull this extra one off. Actually, we'll just use two. And um, you can pull on it and just press that on it, so it'll still stick. <clears throat> And so, <clears throat> I'm just going to, I think I'm going to pull out another one. Just leave those for later. I actually like this one. It's definitely time consuming. It's not time consuming with these type of gemstones. And I probably will go back to Walmart and buy some more because I really like them. No, don't pull. Oh, and I also wash my hands too to make sure that um, that would you know so that my hands are clean and that it'll definitely stick. But do you see how it's stretching? I love it. And you don't want to pull too hard because then it'll rip apart. See how easy that is? And this will make a wonderful gift. Uh oh. Pulled a little too hard on it. That's okay. So, again, I don't know, I don't have any music, but I do have my son in the background. And so, um,. Yeah, to keep him occupied, <laughs> he can watch cars. Uh -oh. 
then now I'm going to use the little three that I had. So now I'm just going to take half of this because I'm pretty sure I won't need that many. I don't need a whole strip. I think this is really good. And whatever I don't need, you just take it. And that's it. And there you go. So now I'm going to, like I was saying earlier, um, to hold the picture in place. I'm going to go ahead and wipe the inside out. Okay. And these are five by sevens. Five, I think they're five by, they're eight inch, eight, eight by ten inch and five by seven inches. So I guess if you take this out, you can use it as a eight by ten. And then with this frame, it makes it a five by seven. So, because I have the white strip on here, and I didn't cut it because it gives, um, it is a five by seven, but it's just the way the, the picture printed out. So I'm going to measure it, so to make sure that this white part doesn't show. So I have it where I want it. I'm going to go ahead and use my glue gun and make sure it's still good because <laughs> I thought I felt it move. And I'm just going to slightly lift it up, use a little bit of glue, and then whatever's left on here, you can just smooth it over the top. It's not going to hurt it. And it's better to just go along the frame versus the picture uh, because then the glue will probably be a little higher than what you want it to be. <clears throat> it's a piece of glue. It's not going to hurt anything. So all I'm doing is I am placing the glue right there on the corner. And that's it. And you know what made me use this? I was looking for some tape and I couldn't find any tape. <laughs> so I said, I just use this. It'll, do, it'll be the same thing. Okay, let it dry. Check and make sure that it's in there properly. And I don't know how you, you guys don't have to put the original picture that was in there, but I, I do. I don't know. I do. It's not going to hurt anything. So <laughs> put it back in there. Okay. And we are just about done. And there you go. 
And there you go. Bye.